And welcome back YouTube, this is Booster Backsbuster here with something truly special today. Today I'm going to be opening up a, a 2016 holiday gift exchange, a Christmas gift exchange if you will, uh, from uh, Valke Inc. Uh, me and her did an exchange last year and we decided to do a gift exchange this year. We really enjoyed it last year and I thought it would be really fun to do it again. Uh, basically what we traded was... Uh, or, or what this exchange includes is basically just stuff that we had extras of, you know, uh, anime figures, uh, video games, uh, training cards, you know, j just stuff like that, you know, stuff that we did not need anymore. Uh, the point of this was not to go out and buy something, but to just, you know, just to trade extra stuff that you had lying around the house, you know, and uh, I I really enjoyed it last year. I love gift gifting. I hope she really likes my end. Uh, I'm I'm sure whatever she gifted me, I'll like just as much. All right. And without and just to share with you guys today, I'm I'm gonna be using Marissa as a backdrop. A very lovely wall scroll here. I think that this would be perfect for today's uh, gift uh, gift video. Uh, I the I did just open the box and remove the flat that had all the information on it because I didn't want to accidentally reveal you know. Uh, information so I did not look inside all I did was remove that flap without further ado oh wow this box looks really full <laughs> I might be feeling bad already all right I'm gonna move this to the side and I'm gonna pull out the first item here uh, this looks to have a letter on it I'm gonna remove that just because in case there's Anything personal on here? Oh, that is a really lovely letter. Merry Christmas once again. As always, thank you so much for doing this gift exchange. Uh, more than that, thank you for being such a kind friend here on YouTube. Always look forward to your videos. Hope we can continue this tradition. Oh, from Valkay Inc. That's a really nice letter. Thank you so much, Valkay. Here's the first present in the box. It has an awesome uh, card of Crocodile on the cover here. Always love Crocodile cards, so that is a, an awesome first gift. Uh, is this from the car, uh, Cardas, or is this from the... Uh, oh, this is from the uh, One Piece Berry Match, I think that's what it's called. But very, very cool. I've gotten a few of these cards from Valkay in the past, and they're just such a love. They have such a lovely art from the One Piece ca uh, line of characters. And the nice thing about this series is they have uh, uh, they do a lot of cards from characters that the uh, actual uh, Miracle Battle Cardaeus don't don't make. You know, they make a lot of like the smaller villains. You know. Bigger villains, smaller villains, you know, if it, if they appeared in one piece, there's a good chance they have a card in this series, which is really nice. Here's our first present. No idea what's in here. Really lovely wrapping paper. Let's see instructions. Are you serious? I got a Fates Collide uh, Pokemon uh, Battle Pack, or Triple Pack here with a Zygar pin. That is so unexpected. Uh, Val, I hope you didn't go out and buy this. I feel really bad if you did. Uh, this uh, this is a really awesome gift. Three, three free Pokemon packs here with the lovely Zygar pin. That's a really awesome gift. If I... It, if I have time here, I'll definitely open up on those up at the end of this opening here. Stick around for that. That's a good way to keep you guys around. All right, let's check out gift number two here. Oh, what the heck? Now let's open it up right now. Anticipation. Super excited to see what could be in here. Maybe we can pull a full art card. That would be super awesome. Sorry if any bumps on the camera there. 
All right. Here's a free code card for you guys. Let's see if I can remember the trick. One, two, three. And then one, two. I believe that's how it works. We got a very lovely swine up. Or sorry, not swine up, snubble. Kind of hiding underneath the table there. Burmy. Cottony. Uh, Riolu, Gothita, Dugong, really lovely, simple, simplistic art uh, with the shimmering water there, really lovely card. N, always cool, uh, Helix Fossil Almanite, our reverse is a Carbank, is that a rare? That is a common, and our rare is Lugia, very cool art, uh, surging through the storm there, very cool. Very lovely card. We got a uh, Zagard uh, alt, uh, alt, uh, alternate. I forget exactly what form it is. Ultimate form, but very cool. The very first card is a Larvitar. Here's a free code for you guys. So we get a little surprise opening to start this, so that's always cool. We got Larvitar, Volaby, Burmy, Coffin, Meowth, that's right, Laudrid, Kabuto, not the Naruto Kabuto, Wormadon, well, that's unexpected. I don't know if I've ever pulled a worm or not. Larvitar Reverse. And our rare is a uh, Mothram. Okay. Kind of the uh, Venomoth of the series. Neo Venomoth. We got Meowth, that's right, as our first card in this pack. Here's one more free code card for you guys. Hopefully you guys are getting something good on this uh, special Christmas edition of Booster Box Buster. Oh, I think we got something really good this pack, guys. I think we got something really good. Let's see if those come true. We got Meowth. Another Larvitar. Diglett. Reverse Diglett wouldn't be bad. Spoink. Riolu. Uh, Almanite. Love Almanite. Almanite's a really cool card. Last is special. That one wouldn't be bad to get reverse either. Uh, Wigglytuff. Ooh, -hoo -hoo! what an awesome pack. We got a, a Break Carbank. That is cool. And uh, Reunclus. That rever or that Break Carbank. That is a pretty cool pull, guys. Nice. That definitely made the uh, the set there. And then, of course, we got this very lovely Zygar pin. Very cool. Love that. Zygar is a, this uh, snake serpent form I really like. Put those to the side. So Pokemon cards is always a great way to start a gift exchange. Especially that carb, that break carbank. That was an epic pull. I really liked that. All right. So that was our first gift. Very cool. Very cool way to start. All right. Let's take a look at our second gift. Ooh, sounds like it could be. It's heavy. It's hefty, that's for sure. Ooh, what do we have here?
Oh wow, that is unique. Pose skeleton. So it's like a uh, a little room that you can build, uh, like a display. I'm guessing out of the box, and then you can put uh, like a skeleton dog and a skeleton human, and then uh, other uh, utensils in there. That is different. I would I would have never have guessed that. You got two different skeleton humans, and then a skeleton kid, and then a skeleton animal. Hey, there they are having a nice cup of tea. Very cool. I would have never have expected that. That is a unique gift. I will have to showcase that sometime. So Pose Skeleton was our number two gift. Very cool. Still love that card. That is that is an epic card. All right, our next gift comes in this nice little uh, shiny shiny package here. We got a red-haired Shanks, guys. Red-haired Shanks is awesome. Let's see. I'm, it's like a minifigure here. Or maybe it's a cutout that you put on a stand there. I'm not quite sure. We got a couple of different characters that we can get. Or that you could get. Uh, Luffy. Looks to be uh, Shanks. Uh... Shanks in two different forms. There's black coat in his uh, younger day form. Then you have Shanks again, so three different Shanks. Uh, what's that guy's name? I know it, I can't remember it. And then you got Usopp's dad, so you got some pretty cool cats in this uh, set here. Let's see, let's, let's take a look at this, see what it is. So we got some Japanese instructions and warnings. Okay, so it seems to be like a uh, an acrylic uh, standing uh, image of Shanks here. Don't want to bump the camera. Oh. <sighs> I forgot I had scissors here. <laughs> in right okay so yeah it's a nice little uh, acrylic shanks self-standing holding the the straw hat there very cool very cool image indeed I really like that oh, we got ourselves a nice little uh, compact gift here feels like the size of a deck of cards Ooh, we got some One Piece cards. I'm pretty sure it's One Piece. Oh yeah, we got some One Piece cards. Nice. We got Nami. Sanji. Zoro. I believe this is from the uh, film Gold, so this is pretty cool. Zoro again. Ooh, Sanji. Uh, looks like he's in the middle of a jump kick. Brook running away from gunfire. Nico Robin. Nami in the with the sunset behind her. Looks probably at the end of the movie. Usopp in action. Uh, come at me, bro, Zoro. Frankie. Uh, uh, is that fiery? Uh, fired up Sanji Chopper, very adorable Chopper Luffy uh, That's one of the villains and I uh, Unfortunately, I do not know the villains names from this movie. Ooh That's the female villain 
in the gold plated armor of the series there. Very cute. Unfortunately I have not seen the movie so I do not know these villains names. Very cool. Hey there's Sabo. Very cool. Tashigi. It's a detective. Ooh, we got a Akuna. The villain from the uh, One Piece Gold movie. Gold, uh, gold plated armor. Another villain. And then we got uh, this cheeky looking guy here. Very nice set of cards. Always, always lovely to get uh, One Piece cards. That's from the new uh, card sets that they have been releasing. Wish they would release more of these. They, they've been kind of trickling out at a slow pace. A very lovely gift, though. Uh, let's save that one. We got a big old gift here. Wonder what the, this could hold. You guys are seeing it as soon as I see it, so I have no idea what could be contained in here. Oh, it's Pokemon! Looks like it's a, uh, a buildable kit of, uh, the Dragonite stages. You can, you have uh, Dratini, Dragonair, and Dragonite. So you can, you have all three sets, and I think it's, uh, kind of like a, just like a small little building kit where you can build all three of them. That's really cool. He was always one of the, uh, or this Pokemon was always one of the... I always loved the middle evolution, Dragonair. I really like that evolution. I think the design is just really uh, elegant for it. I, whenever I played the game, I'd always, uh, I always... I would really never evolve it into a Dragonite. I'd always keep it as a Dragonair. I really love it. I, I really love that Pokemon. But yeah, that's pretty cool. A building kit for dra for dra uh, Dragonite and its evolutions. That's really awesome. I would another gift that I would not have expected. Ooh, this one feels really light, really cool. Let's take a look. Got some great items today. I'm really happy with everything I got. Oh. -ho. We got some Nintendo blind boxes. That's awesome. Let's see what we can get. Gold Mario, uh, Yellow Toad, Nabbit, Peach, bob uh, Luigi, Yoshi, Bullet Bill, Goomba, and Koopa Troopa. Uh, let's see, I'd love to get a bomb bomb Other than that, I, you know, it really doesn't matter to me. Maybe a bullet build? You don't see too many uh, merchandise of those, so that'd be kind of cool. Gold Mario would be, the, would be the best, obviously the best, but I'm not holding my breath for that. Oh wow, it is truly random. It's kind of feeling like a bomb bomb or a toad. Oh, it's a Goomba! Okay. Yeah, you don't see too many merchandise for Goomba either, so that's pretty cool. This this thing is tiny. <laughs> I mean... He, uh, here. I'll give you a good example. Here's the Zygar pin. Here's the Goomba. Yeah, this thing is tiny. I mean... I mean, it's really cool though, but it's just so small. I really like miniatures though, so that is perfect. Such a big box for such a small item. Uh, I think 
think this is going to be a Koopa. I'm pretty sure this is a Koopa Choopa. <laughs> well, you can't have a Mario game with just one Goomba, so we got another Goomba to join him. I do, I, I do not mind having multiples of Goombas. Here, let's see if I can get them into frame here. Maybe I can use these. this as a platform. That work? Good. Barely. There you go. You can kind of see him at the bottom there. <laughs> yeah. I really like the box it comes in, but the tape is so annoying. Okay, guys, this does not feel like a Goomba. <laughs> this does not feel like a Goomba. Oh, it's our best pal, Yoshi! Yoshi! The bongos start playing, Yoshi comes to town. Oh, no, Yoshi doesn't want to stand up, though. He's kind of tough. There we go. There we go, you guys see them down there? We got Yoshi and two Goombas. That, that's a nice little surprise. I like that a lot. Let's see. What else is in here? We got ourselves a nice little, uh, looks like some more cards. Cards are always, always welcome. this I think we got ourselves some Gundam yeah this is totally Gundam Gundam is awesome I love Gundam uh, Gundam Wing I haven't and Gundam Double Zero I haven't seen too many of the other Gundams but those two I've seen a lot of and I know and I really like those we got Nicole uh, Ryu Jose Uh, let's see. Right, he mark. Uh, uh, unfortunately, I do I do not know how to pronounce these guys' names. So sorry about sorry about some of that. I think they have stat information on the back, so I'll show you that. It's mostly in Japanese, so I don't know if that makes a difference or not. There you go. Looks like there's some sort of code up here. Don't know what that means. We got Bernard Wiseman, Sarah, MSO6, Union Flag, the Zaku Tank, Azuda, GM Commander Type. Pretty cool there. That's a cool image. Uh, Gein. Nemo. I'm guessing that's an underwater suit. Oh boy. Zogak. <laughs> One thing I always liked about Gundam was some of the names they, get, they gave him were just completely almost nonsense. <laughs> Helion Space Type, that's a, at least that's a really reliable name. Marasa, pretty cool. Really like that uh, flying at you there. Ooh, there we go, Gundam Ground Type, that is a classic Gundam image there, I like that. Is that the last one? That seems to be the last, oh, and that is a rare too, I didn't even realize that. Till, uh, oh, are they all hollow? Okay, so these two were hollows, so... Sorry, I didn't even realize that until the uh, light hit it there. That is really cool, though. I 
I admittedly never really collect Gundam cards. I have a long time ago when the game came out in the US, but since then, uh, not so much. My big reason is because I don't want to get the names wrong. <laughs> Although it is really nice that they have the English name on front and Japanese on back. That is really nice. And this seems to be the last gift of the box. Put this to the side here. I'm sure whatever it is, I'm going to be super happy with it. Because I really love all this stuff. I mean, I got Pokemon cards, One Piece cards, Gundam cards, all very lovely. Uh, the Dragonite set, the the Pose Skeleton, which I would have, <laughs> I would have never thought of that. The uh, red-haired Shanks, and then of course, the Mario Goombas. I've always thought about picking up those uh, Mario Goomb, these uh, things, and doing a video for you guys. I'm kind of glad I didn't because I didn't realize that they were so small. <laughs> I thought they were a little bit bigger than that. Last gift. Oh wow, we got ourselves some One Piece items. What are these? Oh, okay, so this... She did tell me that there was one item that included gum, but she removed the gum because uh, it was really, really old gum. Which I can completely understand because uh, I probably would have ended up trying it. And probably would have ended up not liking to, or the gum too much. So I have no idea what these are. 150 by 45 cm. You get one, ten. Are these like uh, danglers? Like uh, keychains or something like that? No idea. Let's get into it. We got six of them to open up, so this will be really cool. If it wants to open. There we go. Oh, these are mini posters. Okay, I did not know that. That is pretty cool. That is a pretty cool image there. Sorry about the glare. Here. I'm gonna move these guys to the side here. So I can try to get you a full length image as much as I can. That is cool. I did not expect to get posters, so that is a really cool surprise. Let's see, are these the ones that we can get on the side here? Cha uh, Nami would be really cool. Sanji. Uh, let's see, Killer would be awesome. Uh, Eustace wouldn't be bad. Are the other ones? Uh, yeah, but yeah, Nami, Sanji. Eustace, Keller, let's see if we can aim for those four, that'd be really cool. Frankie wouldn't be bad either. I have to admit, I've never seen a blind poster set before, so that's really cool. Oh, there's the chopper! Doing a crazy, crazy dance. He's wigging out there. That is really cool. I really like that. So let's see what number three holds for us. Ooh, we got a really awesome looking Brook and Frankie combo there. That is epic. I really like that. But yeah, Brooke and Frankie. That is an awesome, awesome poster.
These kind of remind me of the uh, posters that you would put in uh, inside like lockers at school. They're about that size, so that's kind of cool. Oh yeah, we got Sanji. That is epic. That's kind of the one I wanted the most, so that's really cool. Sanji's an, always an awesome character to pull. Let's see, uh, Killer I think would be my next choice. Killer and Nami would be my two ones that I want the most, and then uh, Eustace. And then there looks to be two rare ones, so maybe we can get really lucky and pull one of the rare ones too. Ooh, there's Eustace. That is an awesome pull. With that iron fist there. Really cool. Alright. Let's see, do we have the luck to pull uh, Nami? Or one of the rare ones. Or killer. One of those three would be epic. And our final poster is... Ooh, it's killer. That is nice. Killer is always a cool character to have a poster of. Alright. Well, that was a really nice opening. So I got these really lovely six... One Piece posters. This uh, awesome acrylic uh, self-standing image of red-haired Shanks holding Luffy's hat. Very cool. This super awesome crocodile uh, One Piece Berry Match card. A nice stack of Gundam trading cards. Three very lovely uh, Super Mario Brothers blind items. Uh, two Goombas. And a Yoshi. Yoshi is always cool. We got some One Piece uh, I believe new Miracle Battle Card AS cards. An awesome pack of Pokemon cards with that break car bank. Very, very cool. And this awesome pin of uh, Serpent Zygarde. The Poe Skeleton, which is one of the most unique things that I have seen in a long time. I would have I would have never thought about this. I mean that is really unique. And of course the very awesome Evolution tree, uh, buildable figures of the Dragonite line. Very, very cool. This is Booster Box Buster with the how. Thank you. I have to say before I sign off. Thank you so much, Valka Inc, for doing this. I really enjoyed all the gifts that you that you gave me this year. They they are really fun. Uh, the posters will be really cool. They're small, so I can easily post them up. Oh, the cards were just really nice. The Pokemon set, that was really unexpected. Got a couple of really good pulls out of there. The post skeleton, I have to admit, this is... I'm going to have some fun with this. This is really cool. I can break this out around Halloween and have some really a great amount of fun with that. The Pokemon Evolution Tree, that was really cool. So yeah, we got some great items. I thank you so much for doing this. I hope we can do this again next year. I hope you like your site as much as I liked as as much as I liked my site here. Just a really great amount of items. Oh uh, yeah, this is Booster Box Buster with the uh, Christmas Gift Exchange 2016 edition with Valka Inc. Signing out.